This is the perfect time to talk about the significance between the right and the left hand in hoodoo. But before we do, we have to understand the history of hoodoo. So let's talk about that a little bit first. So hoodoo is a set of spiritual practices and traditions that African Americans held on to during the period of enslavement. As many of us know, most of our African American ancestors were from West Africa. And before colonization, many of them were practicing African traditional religions in West Africa, like Akan in Ghana and Ifa in Nigeria and so on and so forth. And they had to work really hard to preserve their spiritual practices and traditions while they were enslaved here in America because, of course, they were banned. And that is where hoodoo comes from. Hoodoo is a combination of various spiritual practices and traditions from various parts of West Africa mostly. When our ancestors were enslaved, they did not have the benefit of being able to stay with their families or their native groups. So they were all basically mixed up and they just shared their information and knowledge with the intention of preserving it and practicing it as a collective. They had to create their own family. So they just shared what they had, including their spiritual practices and traditions. That's why hoodoo is a mix of a combination of spiritual traditions and practices. Now that we understand where a lot of the practices and spiritual workings in hoodoo come from, which is West Africa, let's talk about the significance between the right and the left hand. In most West African cultures, the right hand is seen as the hand of respect or the giving hand. That is why when we are doing any workings, we'll often use our right hand. The left hand is considered a sign of disrespect. If anyone has ever been to Ghana or been around Ghanaians, you know that if you present them with that left hand, whether you're giving them money, you're going to shake their hand, or even like saying hi or bye, that is a sign of disrespect. Traditionally, the left hand will only be used to clean, sweep the floors, or clean yourself after you use the bathroom. It's sometimes referred to as the toilet hand. But the right hand is the hand of receiving, the hand of giving love in abundance. So if you are handing someone money, you will use the right hand. If you are waving hi to someone or greeting someone, you will use the right hand. But if you want to disrespect someone, flip them off, you use the left hand. So in hoodoo, we carry on that tradition. If you are removing energy, sweeping the floor to remove a negative energy, you will use your left hand. If you are blowing cinnamon in your home and doing something for manifestation or abundance, you will use the right hand. You will hold your manifestation paper, your paper with your intentions and your manifestation desires with your right hand. But anything you want removed, anything, if you are doing any removal work, any dispelling work, any burning work, you will use your left hand to do that. Again, hoodoo is all about maintaining the traditions and practices. But again, this differs depending on culture. So you may come from a culture that is very different where, you know, you use the left hand to receive and that is okay. And some people just make a personal decision to use the left hand as the hand of respect because they know their right hand is their toilet hand. So in the end, the hand that you use is really up to you. It's all about the intention.